the high high. This is the mountain and I will come into my town. In this video, we are going to learn uh, how to deal with the equation that has to do with sex. So okay. this question is coming from Mathematics Paper 1, grade 9 in 10. The one that was written last year by grade 9. So now let me fill the rest of these things and see how we can resolve such problems as well. Alright, so the problem is given that E is equal to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So now this is actually a universal set. And then we are given set A, which is which has the elements 1, 3, the 5, 6. And then we also have set B, which is 2, 4, 6, 8. What I want you to learn is set A and set B are subsets of set E. So now, when I say these are subsets, what I mean is they were actually broken from set E. So this one is the universal set. And we, we had to pick the members of set A and set B from the universal set. So if we come to check, one is there in the universal set. Three with the five, five, six, six. These as well are there in the universal set. So after having that, let us say, five, A intersection A. So now, the intersection set is simply the set of elements that are found in the set that are under consideration. So since we are looking at set A and set B, the question is, what are those elements that are featuring in both sets? Those that you can see in both sets. But this time around, what they want us is to find the intersection set of set A and set B complement. So B complement means the elements that are not found in set B. So now since we already have set A, we will need to come up with set B complement. So let's do this. We write set A. 1, 3, 5, 6. Those are the elements which are that. How about B complement? So B complement is actually a set of elements that are not there in set B. So when we check set B is here, we now fall back on the universal set and check which elements are not in set B. So we have a 2, a 2 is there, we have a 4, a 4 is there, we have a 6 in there, a 6 is there, 8, 8 is there. So now those that I haven't cancelled are actually the elements that are not there in set B. So now let's take note of them. That's one. Then we have a three. Then we have a five, a seven, and a nine. Those are the elements that are not there in set B. So now after having come up with that set and we already have set A, what we're going to do is we are going on to find the intersection set of these two sets. So now, what are those elements that are featured in both sets? We have one and one there. We have a three there. We also have a three there. A five is there and five is there. Is there, is there any other element which is there? There is no other element apart from those that we have written so far. So we can now bring in this parenthesis. So we are done. That is actually the intersection set of set A and B complement. Well, if you like the video, hit the like button and don't forget to follow or tap on the subscribe button and then turn on the notification bell so that every time I happen to go out a video, you happen to be alerted. This is your friend and brother, Doc Mountain. Stop blessed.